like I'm not gonna say that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, I'm not gonna say like the the first environments were ugly. I just feel like the environments on the first two games were very thematically appropriate. This one is just like nature. Ah, huh? Hello, dear Collins. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Bramble, the famed botanist. Since I, since I have been unable to grow and study plants, I have taken an interest in collecting animals. Yeah, that oh, good that they just like bailed on after he said that. I would bail too. Uh, no, 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 not, don't even go in there. Let's just get bailed the fuck out of here. Um, okay, I guess that's it. What is happening now? There's this whirlwind thing going on. This is so difficult to, to control, by the way. Um, excuse me. Okay. Now we can, can go, and this is, I like too. Like, you can choose if you want to go to Mechanos or... Or the waterfall world. Both it gives so many options. This game is amazing. Fireball Frenzy. I already love this one. Ooh, this is very inspired by Yoshi's Island. It's like the, the chain chomp level. I don't remember the name of the chain chomp level. Oh yeah, I like this one. Wait, can I blow this up? This is very sus. Um, lava pools? Excuse me? Hello? The fuck? I guess they ju they ju don't don't give a fuck about butts. I mean, I, I guess they do care about butts, but they don't give a fuck about... Lava? Huh. Oh yeah, that was weird. I'm almost back. Can I do the thing? Nope. It hasn't learned how to, to monkey yet. I can't kill the, the buzzers on this one yet, right? With um, throwing them on each on the thing. Ooh, the fucking guitar when we dive thing. Ooh, the bass line. Oh man, I fucking love. I, I was talking about how I felt the uh, the soundtrack was a little eh, at the beginning, but the soundtrack is picking up. Like the water level, jazzy one. The waterfall levels had amazing soundtrack too. I guess the the idea of the um, of the soundtrack is to fit the theme, right? And at the beginning, we're like, yeah, we're just like monkeys. We're monkeying around. We're going. And so I guess the the, the soundtrack kind of had to like reflect that. It's just kind of goofy. We don't have a, much of a purpose. We're just going. And now that we have a purpose, like. Uh, the ambience of the water level was picking up and now that oh man, but I want to go up there Um, no, that's not what I want Can you can you like go up there? Do I have to go the other way around? No, that's not it Okay, that worked Um, excuse me What the fuck happened to your hair? Okay, I found this fucking Diddy Kong just deposing while flying. But yeah, I feel like the, the, the soundtrack is picking up because now we have a purpose. We have things going around for us. Ooh, Squitter. Oh, she's in this game, or they are in this game. Why do I assume everything is a female? That's not the case. Yay! But yeah. I feel like the theming is is just getting there. It's it's the oh I just ah oh, but they take out, it all of me. I feel the theme is like yeah now we have urgency. So yeah, I have the base, the funky line. And on the waterfall level, they had to like give us a, a very 
very chill and ambient music and on the underwater level we had like the the coldness of underwater so yeah i guess it, it makes sense why the soundtrack is only picking up now i should have ended this thought like two minutes ago but i keep getting uh, distracted by new things happening on the screen it's like i have add or something who would have thunked uh, excuse me sir uh, excuse me sir Oh man. Okay, how do I do this? Okay, and now I yeet there. There we go. Not even that hard. Oh lord. Okay, this is King K rules all over again. The first one of uh, that. Oh, I took too long to move. Oh man, I sucked. Did I even get a checkpoint? I should farm lives again. Oh, I did. Uh, I should farm lives again because of the fact that um, I lost all of my 40 li or 30 lives or something. That was not my plan, but I guess I'm here now. Oh, we're just gonna come back here, so it doesn't even matter that I go get the the squitter. What what the fuck is their name again? Squitter, Splinter, Splitter, Juice Man, Spider Bro. Yeah, Spider Bro is pretty good. Jesus Christ, that's a lot of violence happening here. Uh, there's a banana up there. I think I might. Ooh, we found the secret. Squitter. Oh, so I'm, I'm actually seeing it, right? Grab 15 nanners. Okay, focus. I don't want to fail miserably. Three nanners to go. Oh shit and butts. Got it. Easy cut cut. I don't even know what they do. Uh, was I here? Okay. Okay, I was here. This is where I died. Uh, I died because of you. You buttocks. You basole. Jesus. Why are there like tiny owls holding ginormous cannons? I don't want to be rude, but that's kind of weird. Okay, we're monkeying around. The level design on this one, man, I love it. Like you're, they're reusing the same enemy. Like they're just going up. It's so good. The level design on this one is so, mm, so good. I fucking love this one. This Monkey Donker is my favorite already. Monkey Donker. I like how I just, um, I just don't even try to say the the actual name anymore. Bazooka's Barracks. Excuse me. Morning, Kongs! Brigadier Bazooka here! All present and correct, I see! Marvelous! I fought in the Crimean War, and you know... Don't you know, but I've retired from the serve. Who's Big Betsy? She's only the biggest and greatest cannon of all time! What a beauty! It would be splendid to fire her one more time, but she needs some ammo... ...to really get going. Okay. Uh, ammo for your Betsy, whatever that means. Demolition drain pipe, let's go. And I really like the contrast of this. Like, look at this. Like, the first world and the second world were very nature-inspired. This one is very mechanical, very human. Kind of feels like... 
How do I? Oh, I gotta do that. Okay. Already, I love this one, man. Oh, okay. That's that's a uh, an obstacle. Oh no! Why? Why are you annoying? Oh, I should not have looked at you. Okay, checkpoint. Ooh, okay. You died so much on this level as a kid. I mean, uh, it, it can. I can see why, especially as a kid. However, I've um. I, I am not proud of this, but I've beaten uh, Battletoads. And if you played Battletoads, you can. But I squished them. You gotta fall on them just right for them to be squeezed. Um, but you can. I can see why. And if you played Battletoads, you know what I'm talking about. Especially that that 3D segment. Okay, that's a uh, that's a very tough jump right there. Okay, I wasn't expecting them to just, like, grab to the ceiling, but let's go. At least we're halfway there already. This one's so good. Look at it. It's so jammy. Fuck yeah! Man, I underestimated the... Melon. The soundtrack for this one. I'll see who... The, the notification is second. Let me just... At least die or make some progress. Oh shit, I didn't take damage. That's astonishing. Okay, I took damage. Okay, I took damage again. Thank you very much, Kenman fan. <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow. That's very, very sweet of you. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. Okay, can I do the thing though? I'm just, I just want to vibe to. That was a very high jump. I just want to vibe to the song, though. Okay, that's my my ticket out of here. I need to learn the, the level first. There we go. I should not have latched onto the ceiling. Drop. Jump, jump. Wait a second, what is happening? Ah, uh, there is a dude here. Okay, how am I gonna do this? Cause she... Okay, that jump is kinda tough. Okay, I did it. Ha, get wrecked, dude. Fuck yeah, that's a cool one. That's very Battletoadish, but Battletoads is um, two and a half D. You can kind of go like um, front and back on the, the third plane. Swanky side show. I don't want to do swanky shit. Rip saw rage. Let's go. Oh shit! Auto scroller level. Look at the song on this one. Okay, 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 go, 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 go. Okay, this is scary. Man, I, I'm, I'm in love with the, the OST now. i sorry I misjudged you, music. Ah, oh, but. Uh, I, I am, I am getting salt to death. You love a classic. Me too, bro. I mean, I played this game when I was very tiny. It's been like 13, 14 years around. Yeah, so it's been a while. And I played this on my PS2 emulator. It didn't have a SNES back then. Okay, can I... Let me focus to, to do this one, because I, I really like that this game has lots of um, different gimmicks from the first two levels. Like, the gimmicks on the, the, the first and the second game were more, like, um, one-noted. Like, the, um, the red-hot stage where you had to, like, use those balloons. So it's just, like, it's, this, it's a regular stage, but there's balloons that move slowly through the lava. This one has a little bit more variety, I feel. 
I don't know. Um, excuse me? Okay, focus. This one is so good, man. Just on a vibe. But thank you. Welcome to my stream, bro. Good to have you around. I'm sorry if I play very poorly. Um, I'm not very good at platformers, except one of them, which is Super Mario World. And I'm not even using a controller. I'm playing with my keyboard right now. My controller might arrive tomorrow. And when it arrives, I have a plan of, of actually playing Breath of the Wild on uh, my friend who's in chat right now. He's going to borrow me his computer so I can play Breath of the Wild for you guys. He's going to be commentating with me, so it's going to be fun too. I generally don't have um, other people with me commentating because most of the times either my friends don't want to speak in English, since here in Brazil is not a, that common of a thing to, to be an English speaker. But not only that, but whenever I, I do stream and I do some like collab shit, I generally go to his channel. And if you want, and if you know any Portuguese, because I don't know if people around these parts know Portuguese, but if you know, you can check out his channel. <clears throat> ah, I didn't see you, man. I guess I was too fast. I was rushing. I should not have gone for the banana. Oh yeah, totally. Uh, a real switch. Uh, we're just gonna be like, he's gonna be parsecing. Of course, he's playing on his switch, and he's totally just using the emulator on my. The, I mean, not an emulator. He's he's parsecing his <laughs> his screen to me. <laughs> uh, yes, that's what's happening. <laughs> we totally have a real switch. Well, I I didn't even realize. I didn't even read the name of the of the. What the fuck is that? The name of the stage. Look at a tiny little dude with the ginormous bazooka. That's silly. You're a silly one. I like you. There we go. Now we have friends. Why are you so... That one is on steroids. Why, why is he so aggressive? Now we have acid. So good, man. So jazzy. Like the bass line just dragging you along. Ah, oh, not this. Okay, I just have to time it. I don't have to. Ah, uh, run, 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 run. I thought I would. Oh, I could have Squitter here. Oh, man. These guys are very aggressive for some reason now. Wait, what is the purpose of this? I... Okay, that was terrible. Oh, I have to bring it here. Okay, that's too close to my butt. Okay, it's not gonna respawn. Well... Fuck. At least we can just vibe on this guy, like... Hell yeah! <laughs> no, that's not what I wanted to do, but it works. I prefer going with the, with Dixie, which is weird because in DK2 I prefer going with Didi. Wait, there's nothing here? Okay, there's nothing there. Yeah, Nintendo, please don't sue me. I'm totally playing this on my totally real SNES that I totally still have from when I was four. Did I do some form of skip? I think I skipped something. Okay, I almost died. It's never healthy. L look, at see what I mean? The mechanics on this one. Ah, oh, man, I just, I don't know. You can call me a crazy weirdo person, man. But I feel like this game is is yeah, it, it's hitting the right marks on me. Like it's just chill platforming. It still has a good difficulty curve. It has interesting mechanics, interesting gimmicks for each stage. I felt like the first and second one had like a very steep. Like first of all, the second one has a very steep um, difficulty curve. The last stages on the on that level are very on that game. It's very, very, very difficult. 
Like the the things going up to to K rule. Am I going down here? Okay, I'm going down. And like especially the Bramble levels, like it has amazing music, but that music kind of gives me anxiety now because of the of the difficulty spike. Because you have to time, and if you kind of make get it. oh shit, I didn't expect that to happen. Okay, we did it. The the bramble levels. If you made a mistake, you probably hit a bramble or just like go back into the loop, and you have to do like all over again. So I really enjoy this game so far more than the others. This one is new. Wait, what? Oh, low grav! Low grav stage! See what I mean? Creative gimmick. That's not a single note. It's gonna be a whole stage designed around low grav. I'm pretty sure about that. Oh man, I love this game. Will of, this one is the best. I'm gonna go on, on Reddit right now and tell everyone I like this one more so they can cancel me on Twitter. Okay, this is difficult. Yeah, I'm, it's gonna get a little bit of using, getting used to. <clears throat> you agree? That's interesting. People generally prefer the second one. They tell uh, and like with a the passion. They don't really care what your your points are. They just say that the the second one is the best. And I feel like this one has the better level design. So far, at least. I, I'm not sure about the difficulty curve yet, because the game is still pretty straightforward. It's not getting to the, the difficult stages yet. What is the plan here? Maybe I gotta jump when they're up. Okay, it's to the other side. Not gonna whine. I just broke the hitbox. Um, excuse me? Can you use your legs? You're a monkey for fuck's sake. Go on then. There we go. Yeah, I agree. I, I don't have any special attachments to this one. It was just another monkey donger game for me. But I feel like it has the better overall choices. Like, I, I agree that the, the, the first and the second one were, like, more challenging than this one. Like, at this point, like, World 3 now? In World 3, we were having the, the fucking fabled, like, um... Uh, what the fuck? Snow level. With the barrels and... And the... And the, the like, snow storm going around and you had to do, the, like, dodge some stuff. And so, yeah, the game was already getting more difficult. However, I feel like this one is just like is a, is more of a breeze because they're not like making a difficulty curve based on the like the basic movements of the game. They they're making like a, a difficulty curve based on the gimmicks that they're teaching you like one at a time. Like they they taught you about the the low grab as soon as you try to jump for the first time, and they're they're giving like you increasing difficulties of. They're designing the, the stage to be increasingly more difficult as the, the time goes on, based on this. And it's very rewarding. Ooh, new mechanic. What is what is this? What is burp? Wait, this one this one doesn't fire. Huh. It's blue purple squawks. 80 stars, Jesus. <laughs> Okay, this one is hard to control a little bit. Ah, uh, I didn't get there in time. Okay. It's okay. It's fine. Wait, where am I going? Up here or up there? It's up there. And basically, this is gonna teach that you can maybe squeeze through the yeah, you can squeeze through the bees. So it's gonna get even more difficult coming uh, along. Oh, this one can hold stuff. Hmm. Okay, I couldn't do anything about that. 
they still go down very slowly. Maybe because of the... Of the poison gas. Hmm. Okay. I tried. It, it doesn't have any noise for the flapping. Okay. That's my bad. I'm gonna go first. Just in case. Where am I going? Ooh, TK, nice. And I mean, if you probably would pair them together, like all of the three games, I think the w the first one has the best soundtrack, in my opinion, overall. Like, there's no level. As, as much as I hated that level, like, in general. How am I supposed to do this? Ah, oh, butts. As much as I... I loved that, uh, or I hated that level. Like, I despise the design of that level. I still really, really, really enjoy... Okay, let me fit in here. Really? Okay. I still really enjoy the soundtrack. The The, the song was the thing that kept me going. And uh, even though the, the auto-scroller stages that you had to do, like, the, the slow pace... Um, thing with the, the the carts, and then you had to like pick up fuel for the for the road. Even though those stages were st too very hard, I, I didn't hate that those ones as much. Like there's one there that I didn't like. The other ones were were okay. One of them was even fun because it wasn't very long, but still, like the soundtrack was astonishing. The second one had good theming. I feel like the second one has the best theme. It's like um, everything is, is like revolving up around pirates, and there's this pirate feel, and the music really fits the the theme well. And this one has the more chill theme so far. It has already a, a few amazing ones, but I feel like the, the the level design on this one is is more fitted for like each stage, as in the other two games, the the level the level design was like more of a, a broad spectrum. Like, the levels teach you about all of the mechanics early on, and then they, like, ramp the entire difficulty of the game from there, and teach a few things along those way. This one is kind of, like, teaching you a little bit each stage, and the, the, the difficult curve, like, kind of does a, a sine wave. I don't know, I just enjoy this one more so far. And I'm giving my, my thoughts right now. Boss. What the fuck is it? It looks like a, a click Kong's enemy. You must be destroyed. Okay. Uh, I don't know what to do yet. But, I don't know. I feel like this one has just tickled my fancy a little bit more. And I'm giving my thoughts now, even though I... What is happening? What? What? My point is that I generally give my thoughts... Is that a platform? Okay, so that doesn't hurt me. It's just a platform. Okay. Um, I feel like this one gives me... Or rather, the I generally give my thoughts at the end of the, the thing. Okay, that is a platform. It's kind of hard to jump on, though. I don't know when it's... Where it is on the third plane. I generally give my thoughts at the end of the of the playthrough, but I'm giving some of them right now because I just feel like it's it's really showing a few things. Is that damage? Did I do the damage? Wait, that didn't count? Wait, wait, can I do this? And that costed me a little bit. Ah, oh, but... Okay, that's two. Is it five? Do the thing, do the thing. Ah, oh, the lingering effect. <clears throat> that's a cool boss, though. It's very different. Very creative. Best click, Kong's enemy. Yes, I get what you're saying, bro. Get over it.
Hmm. It's a little bit weightish. You gotta wait for the the opportunity to and I'm gonna get punched. You gotta wait for the opportunity to rise so you can attack him. And I mean as long as it's not overused, I feel like it's fine. It's a fine mechanic where the, the enemy kinda dictates the the base of the god damn it, the base of the battle. I feel like I'm not making any, any progress. I wish it was a little bit more like clear if I'm doing damage or not. Generally the, the, the bosses kind of scream or do a weird noise. Okay, I forgot that's a thing that I couldn't do. Hmm. Oh man, I'm getting sleepy. Not sleepy as in sleep, as in slippage. Okay, now I just don't know why I died. <clears throat> okay, it's gonna take a while to get the, the rhythm of this one. And since it's a little um, weighty, it takes long to, to defeat. Had to watch the, the animation and then wait for him. It only counts when you hit the center of the head. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Like, it's a little weird now. Is that the bounce animation? I mean, it did something different, so I'm gonna assume it is. Okay, that's two. I don't think it can squeeze me against the wall, so I think it's fine if I just butts. Okay, let's try that better. Can I throw Dixie at him? That's the question. Can I throw Dixie at him while he's doing the, the, the spinny, spinny platform thing? Yes, beast, I'm gonna kill you or whatever. Okay, that doesn't work. Okay, that worked. Okay, I did miss my chance, I guess. Never mind, I'm amazing. I'm just gonna stay in the corner then. Because he can't squish me against the wall. So I can just do this and wait. Okay, I can jump from the first blade to his face. Um, what? I'm confused. Whoa! <laughs> Chad. <laughs> it's just Giga Chad is the real is the real boss of the Donkey Kong trilogy. That sound effect reminds me a lot of um, SNK games like a Metal Slug. Is that all of them? I think I've hit it five times already, right? Uh, what, what are you doing? Bzz, bzz, Kongs, when? Question mark. Is this love? Yay, he's dead, and now I have a... Uh, that. Sup, Absolute G, how you doing, bro? You arrived uh, a little late for the boss fight, but yeah, I'm doing fine, man. Thanks for asking. Uh, what is my purpose in life now? Maybe I gotta talk to one of the the bears. Maybe they gonna give me something. Oh, maybe I should talk to to Funky. Last time he he gave me shit. Good to see you around, man. Welcome to the stream. 
Whoa, dudes, you found two skis. Awesome. I've got all the parts I need to you I I guess I'm not gonna finish what I'm saying. Wait right there, Dixie, while I get you the latest and greatest buck. Bonkers! I've built a cool turbo feature that will sure take you if you press Y and shit. Bust a move! Got a groove! Uh, wait. <laughs> wait, what is the Y button? Is this the Y button? Uh, okay, I guess I can just go up waterfalls. I was kind of suspecting that was the, the plan. But it was kind of a joke inside of my mind. I didn't know it was actually going to be a thing. Honk. Okay, but there's this waterfall here. Maybe I can do some secrets. Um, let me let me try it again. Maybe I can do some secret. Okay, let me try that again. Maybe I can do some secrets. There we go. I'm amazing like that. I can just open holes in walls with my bare hair. Mm -hmm. Which one is the circle one? It's the jump button, right? So it's... But! <laughs> Let's try that again. That's why you should have a controller, kids. That's why you have a controller. But I don't know which one is the one. I'm amazing like that. I just gasped and it worked. So that's my my wins, right? I know. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, wh why am I getting birds again? What is the purpose of birding? Uh, in any case, let's progress. Let's do the progress. Uh, excuse me, sir. Sir. There we go. Uh, we have a dude here, like a monkey. Let me go to the cabin. I cannot go to the cabin? Okay, no direction lets me go to the cabin. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick, and then I'll be back to from our donker energy.